Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today's video is going to be about using the clone tool and why you would want to use it. Over the last several days, I've made videos on how to get this uh, Greek symbol or Az Aztec type symbol to fit this circle. And this is one of the reasons you might want to use the clone tool. So I've got my original drawing. I'm going to go up to edit and I'm going to click clone. So now I've got a clone on that. I'm going to double click and I'm going to get my rotation to the center. Now I'm going to rotate it 30 degrees. Now I can make a duplicate, control D, and I'm going to rotate the, the duplicate 60 degrees. Then control D all the way around. Now this is my original this is a clone and all these are clones even though I made a duplicate of it. So if I wanted to fill this in with black, it's going to fill them all in with black because it's a clone. If you just duplicated it, you would have to fill each one of these individually. Now let's say I don't want an outline. So now all my objects don't have an outline and they're all identical. So let's back up here for just a second. Now you could get rid of your circles. Let's see if we can do that. Get rid of our inner and our outer circle. Maybe a little more difficult than you would think. Tell you what, we're going to move this out of the well. This is when you're going to use, want to use the nudge distance. We'll set it on five inches. We'll nudge this one out of the way five inches so we can definitely click our circle. Now I can nudge this one back. Now I'm going to take away this and I'm going to control G. I'm going to select them all and I'm going to control G so you can get the same effect. So you can, if you didn't clone it, you could still make them all filled in or, or not having hairline. But a lot of times the clone tool is going to be a big beneficiary. And if you haven't watched some of those videos, either mine or some other people, where you could actually change dates on name tags and stuff. So that's the clone tool in re reference to this uh, circle. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.